repeat it again because you know. Hi, um, yeah. So we, I asked a question a while ago about in the press release na one of your inspirations besides Sharon Cuneta and your father is your newfound faith in Christ. So yeah, I want to know more because your story is so inspirational how someone from from the slums suddenly was catapulted by the Lord to where you are right now. And I believe na a lot of us should be lights in, in different places in media and government and business and the values of the family should be brought back as well. So your life is such a great example of someone that was used by God and is being used by God. And even though you you're, you're have a lot of wealth right now, you still don't forget the one who brought you through all of these things. So that's really something that I was touched and I almost didn't go to this event actually. But, but I'm so happy that I met someone like you and I just want you to share what's in your heart and to give glory to God. Um, for what he has done in your life, and this is your opportunity. I'm not really, uh, this is not really a big time uh, coverage yet, but I just wanna, you know, thank God for how much you are a light, and you are being a light uh, in Hollywood and showbiz and in the fashion industry. Uh, first of all, talaga ang um, ang transformation ng buhay ko is na na born again Christian ako. I only ask for. Um, pagkain ka matitira uh, dahil nga uh, nakatira ako sa kain but God gave me all of this na it's really overwhelming dahil um, yung pagbabago ng buhay ko is it's something na hindi magagawa ng normal na tao or yung sarili mo lang na kapasidad um, or sa sarili mo ng lakas. Big, big reason talaga is our Lord Jesus Christ. Dahil ko hindi siya nabago, I guess, nasa kalye pa rin ako. Yung, yung, yung buhay na I'm sure alam ng tao kung gaano kahirap ang buhay sa kalye. Pero na makilala ko ang Lord talagang from glory to glory ng bago buhay ko. Nagkaroon ng kulay, nagkaroon ng... Of course, along the way, marami akong mga... mga... Pinag, pinaglabanan ko ng mga weaknesses. But then again, the Lord never fails to amaze me. And He never turned His back to me. So... Hindi ko lang ito ginagawa for Bantay Bata. Dahil sa gusto kong gawin, I believe God want, wants me to do it. Dahil ito yung conviction talaga. Ito yung nakakasin ko magdaway para sa kamatahan. Yeah, and it's really a dark world right now. So, so the way that people are exploiting children, the values, abortion, you know, the family values. And you also mentioned na when you became born again, you started to, you know, go back to the the right, you know, the way that man is. I actually to. sing in the church. Wow! I can you can you sing one <laughs> one song, oh, like that your favorite worship song? Makasabayan pa kita. Ah, ang favorite ko yung ano yung yung uh, this little child. So may jo ano? Nilipat ko kanta ka sa part. This little child. Uh, Yes, go ahead. Pero one of the best songs na madalas kong kantayin sa Dubai, yung People Need the Lord. I know that song. Say, kanta tayo. We are called to take His light to a world where wrong seems right. What could be too great a cost for Sharing light with one who's lost On they go through private pain Living fear to fear Laughter hides their silent cries Only Jesus hears Thank you, okay, no, 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 <laughs> People need the Lord yes, and the children too.
people need the Lord at the end of broken dreams. He is the open door. People need the Lord. People need the Lord. When when we they realize that we must give our lives for the kids. For people need the Lord. People need the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise God. So, so. Ang ganda, no? He, he suddenly we found out that he sings in, in, in the church. I sing in the church. And he does it for God. And then he's so, he was already put up in a pedestal by God for people to see the goodness of God in his life. So it's not impossible. Now people you who have lost your hopes, lost your dreams, God will still bring your um, future to, the, to a good future like he has. And look at how how a good example is simple lang madaling ka usap hindi ulang yabang nakita and ang nagulat ako sir paano mo na patawad yung mga tao na nag-iwan sa iyo yung father yung baga niya parang pa even the in the world that you are is a dark place the fashion industry the hollywood show and you know sure there's drugs there's all that stuff there so how are you able to stay alive and be a salt in that world that is my last question ng priest um I guess yung, yung, yung faith na nandito sa puso ko is the one who really triggered me para, para purihin ang Lord. So, At sa name of your church yung, pala yung, para mag-greet na natin sila? <laughs> I started in ICS. So I grew up with uh, Ronald Rivera, mm -hmm. Trisha Amper. Ah, yeah. Sila yung, mga, sila yung mga, yung mga kabatch kong mm -hmm. youth during that time. Mm -hmm. so, I'm grateful. Mga naging church ko, World International, wow. Red of Life. Mm. Uh, ngayon nasa Christ the King Fellowship wow. under Pastor Ricky Ross. So hi to those uh, you United Churches. You <laughs> You've done a good job with this guy. So he didn't forget who he is as a son of God, as, a, as one of the children of God. So that's great. You know, he is a light. In, in, in the mountain of influence that he has and it's such a big influence so even when you when you do like designs for celebrities in Hollywood you sometimes share how good God is in your life sometimes there's opportunity to do that yes and I want to tell this to anyone to everyone who has been in MMK the transformation of my life is when I was born again Christian I didn't put it in there so it's Josephine in Hollywood in Middle East nangyari yan born again Christian ako kasi yung dark side is talaga nung kabataan ko uh, walang, walang pagbabago kasi nung hindi ako born again walang direction po yung buhay ko nagkaroon na ng direction nung nakilala ka pa yung Jesus and it's not a religion, it's a relationship yeah, it's that's what we wanna clarify yes. yeah. you really need to know the living God because if it's just religion like man's practices Wala eh. Wala rin dating eh. Walang latoy. Kaya that's the transformation you're gonna show in your fashion show, di ba? Yes. I hope <laughs> talaga mapanood nila yung fashion show kasi maganda. Maganda yung interpretation ko dito sa show dahil it's all about my life, my faith, my strength, my my dream, everything mapapanood nila sa fashion show. Ngayon, meron lang akong one showbiz question. Since I have fans from Leia, what if you did something like for Leia and, and Aga? Will you, let's say they ask, you're gonna do a design for them? What what would you think would be a good design for their old love story? Anong magandang idea mo for them? I wish I can do another show with Leia and Aga. Na sila yung brides and groom. <laughs> yeah, di ba? I'm a big fan of Leia kasi nang, nang nagbidalis ako tayo ng Miss Saigon. So yan mga Leia Aga fans, ha? meron kayong perspective na pwedeng gumawa ng design for Leia and Aga. Thank you, <laughs> Thank you sir. Thank you Thank so you. much.